Have you ever wondered what makes your digital assistant respond to your queries or how your social media feed knows exactly what you're interested in? Welcome to AI Waves channel, your one-stop shop for everything artificial intelligence. We're here to unravel the complex world of AI and make it accessible and enjoyable for all. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated on all things AI. Artificial intelligence or AI is no longer a thing of the future. It's here and it's everywhere. It's in the way your online shopping site recommends products, how your GPS predicts traffic, and even how your email filters spam. But what exactly is AI? Simply put, it's the simulation of human intelligence processes by machines, especially computer systems. It involves learning, reasoning, problem solving, perception, and language understanding. But AI isn't a monolith. It's an umbrella term that encompasses various fields and components like machine learning, natural language processing, robotics, computer vision, neural networks, and deep learning. Each of these components plays a unique role in making AI the transformative technology it is today. First, let's talk about machine learning. It's the ability of a machine to learn and improve from experience without being explicitly programmed. It's the reason why your music streaming app knows your taste in music better than your best friend does. Next, we have natural language processing. This is how your digital assistant understands and responds to your commands. It's the magic behind, hey Siri, or, OK Google. Robotics, on the other hand, involves creating robots capable of carrying out tasks that would otherwise require human intelligence. Think of robots performing surgeries or assembling cars and factories. Computer vision is another crucial component. It enables machines to see and understand visual data as we humans do. It's the reason why your smartphone camera can recognize faces. And finally, we have neural networks and deep learning. These are sophisticated techniques that enable machines to learn from large amounts of data and recognize patterns, just like the human brain does. AI is not just a technology, it's a revolution. It's changing the way we live, work, and interact with the world. And the most exciting part, we're just scratching the surface. With advancements in AI happening at breakneck speed, who knows what the future holds? Today, we're going to unlock the mysteries of artificial intelligence. AI is not just one thing, it's a combination of several different fields and components. It's like a fascinating puzzle where each piece plays a crucial role in creating the bigger picture. So, let's delve into these components to gain a better understanding of AI. First on our list is machine learning, often abbreviated as ML. Picture this. You're scrolling through your Netflix feed, and you notice that the platform is suggesting movies that perfectly align with your taste. You may think it's magic, but it's actually machine learning. Machine learning is a component of AI where computers learn from data without being specifically programmed. They identify patterns, learn from them, and then make predictions or decisions, just like Netflix recommending you movies based on your past viewing habits. Next, we have natural language processing, also known as NLP. Ever ask Siri for the weather or Alexa to play your favorite song? You've used natural language processing. It's the ability of a computer program to understand human language both in text and speech. NLP is a key player in enabling our interactions with AI technologies, from chatbots to voice assistants. Following up, we have robotics. No, we're not talking about the sci-fi Hollywood robots. In the realm of AI, robotics is the intersection of AI and mechanical engineering. It's all about designing, constructing, and operating robots to perform tasks that humans either can't or prefer not to do. Think of robots assembling cars in factories or performing intricate surgical procedures. It's pretty amazing, right? Next on our list is computer vision. This is the technology that allows computers to see and interpret visual information. From facial recognition systems unlocking your smartphone to self-driving cars navigating through traffic, computer vision is a key component of many AI applications we use today. Last but definitely not least, we have neural networks and deep learning. These are complex algorithms inspired by the human brain's structure and function. They help machines recognize patterns and solve complex problems. Have you ever wondered how Google Photos can identify and categorize your images? That's the magic of neural networks and deep learning. So, we've unpacked the main components of AI, machine learning, natural language processing, robotics, computer vision, and neural networks and deep learning. Each of these components has its unique role and applications, from movie recommendations and voice assistance to robotics and image recognition. But what's more fascinating is how these components work together. 
For instance, a self-driving car uses machine learning to learn from past driving data, computer vision to interpret the road and its surroundings, and robotics to physically control the vehicle. It's the combination of these components that powers the diverse and ever-expanding applications of AI. Each of these components contributes to the myriad applications of AI we see today. They're like the ingredients in a recipe, each adding its unique flavor, resulting in a dish that's more than the sum of its parts. And similar to how mastering a recipe requires understanding each ingredient, understanding AI requires a deep dive into its components. Remember, AI is not just a single technology, it's a blend of several fields and components, each with its unique roles and applications. From the voice assistant on your phone to the recommendation engines on your favorite platforms, AI is revolutionizing our world, one component at a time. So, how does one get into the fascinating field of AI, you might wonder? Well, it's a journey that requires a blend of diverse skills, a hefty dose of curiosity, and a commitment to continuous learning. Firstly, you'll need a solid foundation in mathematics, specifically in areas like algebra, calculus, and statistics. These are the building blocks that help make sense of the data that AI systems learn from. If you're not a math whiz, don't worry. There are plenty of online resources available to help you strengthen your math skills. Next up, you'll need to get comfortable with programming. Python is the most popular language in AI due to its simplicity and vast range of libraries designed specifically for AI and machine learning. Start with the basics and work your way up. Again, the internet is your friend here, loaded with tutorials, online courses, and community forums. Once you have a good handle on Python, it's time to dive into machine learning. Machine learning is a huge part of AI, and understanding its principles will be crucial as you move forward. Start with simple models and gradually take on more complex algorithms. Now while the theory is important, practical experience is key. Apply what you've learned by working on projects big or small. This could be anything from building a chatbot to creating a model that predicts stock prices. Not only will this give you hands-on experience but it will also help you build a portfolio that can showcase your skills to future employers or clients. Competing in challenges is another great way to gain practical experience. Platforms like Kaggle host numerous data science competitions where you can test your skills against others from around the world. It's a fantastic way to learn, grow, and even get noticed by industry professionals. As you advance, you might choose to specialize in a particular area of AI like natural language processing, computer vision, or robotics. Each of these fields has its own unique challenges and rewards, and it's worth exploring them to see which one sparks your interest the most. Finally, remember that the field of AI is always evolving. New techniques and technologies are being developed all the time. To stay on top of the game, you need to be dedicated to continuous learning. Follow industry news, attend seminars and workshops, take advanced courses, and never stop asking questions. In conclusion, breaking into AI is a journey of constant learning and hands-on experience. It requires a mix of skills from mathematics to programming and a deep interest in how machines can learn and evolve. It's a challenging field, no doubt, but for those with the passion and perseverance, it's a journey filled with endless possibilities and rewards. Remember, the key to success in AI is continuous learning and practical experience. The demand for AI skills is skyrocketing across industries. That's not just a catchy phrase, it's the reality of today's job market. As AI continues to revolutionize industries from healthcare to finance, the need for professionals skilled in AI is growing at an unprecedented rate. Let's delve into some of the hottest career opportunities in the AI field. First up, machine learning engineers. These are the wizards who create and maintain machine learning systems. They're experts in complex algorithms and work with vast amounts of data to train models. They're the ones who make Netflix's movie recommendations eerily accurate or help autonomous vehicles navigate tricky traffic situations. Next, we have data scientists. They're the detectives of the AI world, extracting meaningful insights from heaps of data. They use statistical techniques and machine learning to analyze and interpret complex data sets and help businesses make data-driven decisions. Then, there's AI research scientists. These are the visionaries, the ones pushing the boundaries of what's possible with AI. They conduct research to create and improve AI technologies, working on cutting-edge projects like developing more human-like AI or cracking the code of artificial general intelligence. We also have AI ethicists, a relatively new but increasingly important role. They're responsible for ensuring that AI technologies are developed and used ethically, considering aspects like privacy, bias, and societal impact. Their work is crucial in building a future where AI benefits all of humanity. 
And let's not forget about robotics engineers. They design, build, and maintain robots combining AI with mechanical and electrical engineering. Whether it's a robot that assembles cars or a robotic arm that performs delicate surgery, robotics engineers are at the heart of it. These are just a few examples. The AI field is vast and ever-evolving with new roles and specializations emerging all the time. Whether you're interested in natural language processing, computer vision, or any other subfield of AI, there's likely a career path for you. Now, you might be thinking, that sounds amazing, but how do I get there? Well, it's a journey. It starts with a strong foundation in mathematics and programming, particularly in Python. From there, you'll want to dive into machine learning and then specialize in the area that interests you most. And remember, hands-on experience is key. Engage in projects, take part in competitions, and never stop learning. The potential for growth in these careers is tremendous. According to a report by LinkedIn, AI specialist roles have grown by 74% annually in the past four years. And this trend isn't slowing down anytime soon. So if you're ready to take the plunge, there's no better time than now. With the right skills, passion, and perseverance, you can be at the forefront of shaping the AI-driven future. The future is indeed bright for those ready to dive into AI. Artificial intelligence is not just a technology of the future, it's here, now, shaping our lives in ways we can't even imagine. We've navigated the vast ocean of AI together today, diving deep into its components, exploring its potential, and charting pathways to a future where AI is an integral part of our lives. We began our journey by defining what AI is and how it works. We discovered that at its core, AI is the simulation of human intelligence by machines, learning not through experiences and reasoning, but from data. We then took a closer look at the various components of AI, machine learning, natural language processing, robotics, computer vision, neural networks, and deep learning, all working together to create the AI systems that are becoming increasingly prevalent in our world. We also explored the exciting career opportunities that AI presents. From machine learning engineers to AI research scientists, the demand for AI professionals is on the rise in every industry. We discussed the skills you'll need to begin your AI journey, a mix of mathematics, programming, and a thirst for continuous learning. But remember, the journey into AI is not just about acquiring skills and landing a job. It's about the potential of this incredible technology to transform our world. From revolutionizing healthcare and transportation to solving some of our biggest environmental challenges, AI has the potential to shape our future in ways we can only begin to imagine. So, whether you're a budding AI enthusiast or simply curious about the technology that's reshaping our world, we hope this video has sparked your interest and inspired you to learn more. Thank you for joining us on AI Waves channel. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for more exciting dives into the world of AI. Hey there, tech enthusiasts! Before we dive into the fascinating world of machine learning, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay updated with all our latest content. Now let's get started. Machine learning, or ML, is a term that's been gaining quite a bit of traction lately. But what exactly is it? Well, in the simplest terms, it's a subset of artificial intelligence that's all about teaching machines to learn from data, identify patterns, and make decisions. All this happens with minimal human intervention, which is pretty impressive if you ask me. Think about it this way. You know how when you were a kid, you learned by observing and understanding things around you, you touched a hot stove and it burned so you learned not to touch it again. That's essentially what machine learning is. Except in this case, the kid is a machine and the stove is a massive amount of data. But it's not just about avoiding metaphorical stoves. Machine learning can be used for so much more. It can teach a computer to recognize your voice among thousands of others, predict the weather based on patterns, or even play a game of chess. And it's not just limited to that. The applications are as vast and varied as the data we can provide. Why does this matter to you? Well, it's because machine learning is becoming more and more intertwined with our daily lives. It's the technology behind the recommendations you see on your favorite streaming service, the spam filter in your email, and so much more. It's shaping our future, making processes more efficient, and unlocking the potential for innovations we've yet to dream of. So whether you're a tech enthusiast looking to explore new horizons, a business owner seeking to leverage data for better decision making, or just a curious mind wanting to understand the world better, machine learning has something to offer you. Imagine teaching a computer to recognize your voice, predict the weather, or even play chess. That's ML in action. So stick around as we delve deeper into this fascinating world in our upcoming sections.
Why should you care about ML? Because it's everywhere. Machine learning is like the silent power behind many services we use daily, often without even realizing it. It's the magic that powers the recommendation engine on your favorite streaming service, suggesting shows and movies perfectly tailored to your taste. It's the intelligence behind your email's spam filter, working tirelessly to keep your inbox clean and clutter-free. Machine learning is also the secret ingredient that makes your virtual assistant so helpful. It's the reason why Siri, Alexa, or Google Assistant can understand your voice commands, answer your questions, or even tell a joke when you need a laugh. It's the technology that enables Google's search engine to provide you with accurate results in fractions of a second, making your online experience smooth and efficient. But machine learning isn't just about making our lives more comfortable, it has the potential to address some of the world's most pressing issues. In healthcare, machine learning algorithms can analyze vast amounts of data to predict diseases, personalize treatments, and ultimately save lives. In finance, machine learning can help detect fraudulent transactions, making our online transactions safer. And let's not forget about its role in advancing scientific research, from understanding climate change to exploring outer space. Machine learning is also a key driver of future innovations. It's the force behind the development of self-driving cars, advanced robotics, and smart homes. It's the technology that's pushing the boundaries of what machines can do, reshaping industries and creating new opportunities. But perhaps the most exciting thing about machine learning is its potential for growth. We're just scratching the surface of what this technology can do. As more data becomes available and algorithms become more sophisticated, the possibilities for machine learning are virtually limitless. So why should you care about machine learning? Because it's not just a buzzword or a trend, it's a transformative technology that's already changing our world and promises to play a pivotal role in shaping our future. ML technologies are shaping our future, making processes more efficient, and unlocking the potential for innovations we've yet to dream of. At its core, ML involves feeding data into algorithms to train models. Imagine you're teaching a child to identify animals. You start by showing pictures of different animals and naming them. The child over time begins to associate images with names. That's pretty much how machine learning works. But instead of children, we have models and instead of animal pictures, we have data points. Machine learning is a process of training models with data. Now what's a model? In simple terms, a model is a mathematical representation of a real-world process. For instance, a weather prediction model might include factors like temperature, humidity, and wind speed. The more accurate our model, the better it can predict future weather patterns. The first step in machine learning is data collection. We need a large amount of data to train our models. The quality and quantity of data directly impact the model's performance. It's like the saying goes, garbage in, garbage out. If we feed our model with poor quality data, we can't expect accurate predictions. Once we have our data, we split it into two sets, a training set and a test set. The training set, as the name suggests, is used to train the model. The test set on the other hand is used to evaluate the model's performance. It's like a pop quiz for our model to see if it has learned well. Now let's talk about the different types of learning in machine learning. First, we have supervised learning. It's like a guided tour. We have labeled data, which means we already know the output for each input. It's like showing a child a picture of a dog and saying, this is a dog. The model learns from this direct feedback. Next, we have unsupervised learning. Here, the model is like a child exploring a park alone. The data is not labeled and the model has to find patterns and relationships in the data on its own. It's like giving a child a bunch of animal pictures and letting them group the pictures in any way they see fit. Lastly, we have reinforcement learning. It's like learning to ride a bike. The model learns through trial and error. It makes decisions, receives feedback, and adjusts its actions based on that feedback. Over time, the model learns to make better decisions to maximize the reward. Once the model is trained, it's time to test it. We use the test set data to evaluate how well our model can predict new data. If the model performs well, great. If not, we go back to the drawing board. We tweak the model or get more data and train it again. It's important to note that machine learning is not a one-time process. As we get more data, we can continue to train our model and improve its accuracy. The goal is to have a model that can make accurate predictions or decisions based on the patterns it has learned from the data. Over time, the model learns and improves its accuracy in making predictions or decisions. Just as a child becomes more adept at identifying animals with practice, 
our model becomes better at making accurate predictions with more training. Let's look at some examples. Machine learning, this technological marvel, has been quietly integrating itself into various sectors, transforming them in significant ways. Take healthcare, for instance. The world of medicine has been revolutionized by machine learning. Doctors and researchers are now using ML models to predict diseases even before symptoms appear. These models analyze a patient's medical history, lifestyle, and genetic information to draw up predictive analyses. This early detection can be a game-changer making preventative measures and treatments far more effective. But that's not all. Machine learning is also personalizing treatment plans. By analyzing individual patient data, ML algorithms can suggest treatments that are most likely to work for a specific patient, considering their unique genetic makeup and health history. This move towards personalized medicine is improving patient outcomes and reducing healthcare costs. Now let's switch gears and talk about finance. Here, machine learning models are being used to detect fraudulent transactions. They analyze patterns in transaction data and flag anomalies that could indicate fraud. This ability to spot irregularities in real time is helping financial institutions prevent losses and protect their customers. And what about the entertainment industry? Well, if you've ever wondered how Netflix seems to know exactly what you want to watch next, that's machine learning at work. ML algorithms analyze your viewing history, the ratings you give, and even the time you spend watching a particular show. Then, they use this data to curate a personal watch list filled with movies and shows you're likely to enjoy. But these examples are just scratching the surface. Machine learning is also driving advancements in sectors like transportation, where it's powering self-driving cars, in retail where it's predicting consumer behavior and optimizing inventory, and even in agriculture, where it's helping farmers predict crop yields and manage resources more effectively. And let's not forget about the role of machine learning in our everyday lives. From voice assistants like Siri and Alexa learning to understand our commands, to spam filters in our email learning to recognize and block unwanted emails, machine learning is making our lives easier and more efficient in countless ways. These examples should give you an idea of the vast potential of machine learning. It's not just about creating intelligent machines, it's about using data to make better decisions to improve efficiency and to drive innovation. And the best part? We're only just beginning to explore what's possible. These are just the tip of the iceberg. But it's not all smooth sailing. As we delve deeper into the world of machine learning, we encounter significant challenges. One of the most pressing of these is data privacy. With machine learning algorithms requiring vast amounts of data to function effectively, questions naturally arise about how this data is collected, stored, and used. Especially when it comes to sensitive information, the risk of data breaches or misuse is a serious concern that must be addressed. Another challenge is the ethical use of artificial intelligence. As machines become more intelligent and autonomous, it's crucial to establish guidelines to prevent misuse. For instance, we need to ensure that AI doesn't replace human jobs indiscriminately or become a tool for surveillance and control. It's also important to prevent the creation of AI weapons, which could have devastating consequences. Finally, there's the risk of biased outcomes. Machine learning models are only as good as the data they're trained on. If this data is biased in any way, the model's predictions and decisions will be biased too. This can lead to unfair outcomes, such as discriminatory hiring practices or unjust law enforcement. To combat this, we need to carefully curate our training data and regularly audit our models for bias. But these challenges aren't insurmountable. By promoting transparency in data collection, establishing ethical guidelines, and actively working to eliminate bias, we can work towards a future of machine learning that is both powerful and fair. In the end, the goal is not just to create intelligent machines, but to use these machines to improve the human experience. To create a world where technology serves us, rather than the other way around. Where it enhances our abilities, solves our problems, and opens up new possibilities. As we advance, it's crucial to address these issues to ensure a future where technology benefits everyone. Inspired to embark on your own ML journey? Well, you're in the right place. Machine learning is a vast field, but don't let that intimidate you. Think of it as an adventure filled with numerous paths to explore and countless treasures to discover. Firstly, you'll need a solid foundation. There's a multitude of online platforms offering comprehensive courses on machine learning. Coursera, EDX, and Udemy, to name a few, are teeming with resources to help you grasp the basics and beyond. Many of these courses are designed by industry experts and top universities, ensuring you get quality education from the comfort of your home. 
Now don't just stop at learning the theory. Machine learning is a hands-on discipline. Get your hands dirty with real-life datasets. Websites like Kaggle and UCI Machine Learning Repository offer a plethora of datasets for you to practice on. From predicting house prices to identifying handwritten digits, there's something for everyone. But remember, learning doesn't have to be a solitary endeavor. Join ML communities and forums. Sites like Stack Overflow, GitHub, and Reddit have thriving communities where you can ask questions, share your projects, and learn from others' experiences. Collaboration is key in the world of machine learning. Additionally, keep an eye on the latest research papers and articles. Platforms like Google Scholar, ArcSiv, and Medium regularly feature cutting-edge research and insightful articles in the field of ML. This will keep you updated with the latest trends and advancements. Lastly, don't shy away from experimenting. Try out different algorithms, tweak parameters, and play around with various tools. Remember, in machine learning, there's no one-size-fits-all solution. What works in one scenario might not work in another. So, are you ready to set sail on your machine learning voyage? Remember, the path to mastering ML is a marathon, not a sprint. Stay curious and keep learning. Let's make the most of this fascinating journey together. And that wraps up our introduction to machine learning. We've embarked on a journey through the fascinating world of ML, from understanding its basics and importance, to seeing it in action in various industries. We've also touched upon the challenges it brings and the ethical considerations we must bear in mind. As we move forward, let's continue to question, learn, and innovate, ensuring that this powerful tool is used for the betterment of all. Remember, the future of ML holds limitless possibilities and it's up to us to shape it. So, stay curious, keep learning, and never stop exploring. If this video sparked your interest in ML, show us some love with a thumbs up, and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to AI Waves channel for more insights into the world of artificial intelligence and machine learning. Until next time, keep exploring the waves of AI and ML. Welcome to AI Waves channel, your go-to destination for unraveling the mysteries of artificial intelligence and technology. Before we dive into the incredible world of natural language processing or NLP, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe and ring the bell to stay updated with our latest content. A quick disclaimer. All information presented is for educational purposes and to spark curiosity in the advancements of AI technology. Today we're embarking on an exciting journey into the heart of natural language processing, or NLP. It's a field that's transforming the way humans interact with machines, breaking down the barriers of communication one algorithm at a time. Imagine a world where machines can understand and respond to human language as naturally as another human. Welcome to the fascinating field of natural language processing, or NLP. This remarkable branch of artificial intelligence is changing the game, allowing us to interact with machines in ways we could only dream of a few decades ago. Whether it's asking your smartphone about the weather, or using a translation app to communicate in a foreign country, NLP is the brilliant technology behind it all. It's all about breaking down the barriers of communication, making our interactions with machines more intuitive, more meaningful, and more human. From the simplest of tasks to the most complex of conversations, NLP is transforming our world one algorithm at a time. So buckle up as we embark on this thrilling journey into the heart of natural language processing. Now let's delve deeper into this captivating world of NLP. The journey of NLP is a tale of continuous evolution and innovation. Our story begins in the 1950s, a time when computer science was in its infancy. Pioneers in the field dreamed of machines that could comprehend and converse in our natural languages. Early attempts at NLP were rule-based systems, programmed with an extensive set of grammatical rules and a dictionary to translate sentences into different languages. However, these systems were limited, struggling with the inherent ambiguity and complexity of human language. Entering the 1970s, the focus shifted to statistical methods. These systems leveraged the power of probability and statistics to understand language, making them more flexible and capable of learning from real-world examples. But they were still not perfect, often producing grammatically incorrect sentences. The 1990s brought about a significant shift with the advent of machine learning. Machine learning models were trained on large amounts of data, learning to predict the next word in a sentence or the appropriate response to a query. This era gave birth to groundbreaking technologies like IBM's Watson, which famously won the game show Jeopardy in 2011. Fast forward to the 2010s, and we witness the dawn of deep learning in NLP, 
deep learning models such as recurrent neural networks and transformers have taken NLP to new heights. These models excel at understanding context, capturing long-range dependencies in text, and even generating human-like text. Today we're in the era of transformers and models like BERT, GPT-3 and T5 which have revolutionized NLP. They're capable of understanding and generating language with an uncanny accuracy, powering everything from Google search to automated customer service chatbots. The evolution of NLP is a testament to human ingenuity and the power of machine learning. It's a journey marked by continuous learning, iteration, and improvement. And thus, we arrive in the present day, with NLP technology more advanced than ever before. But remember, this is not the end. As we continue to push the boundaries of what's possible with AI and machine learning, who knows what the future holds for NLP? Ever wondered how machines can understand human language? Let's break it down. The process of natural language processing, or NLP, can be divided into three main steps, text parsing, natural language understanding, and natural language generation. First, we have text parsing. This is where an NLP system breaks down a chunk of language, whether it's a sentence, a paragraph, or an entire document, into smaller, more manageable parts. It's like a chef chopping up ingredients before cooking. Each word, phrase, and sentence is carefully dissected to understand its structure and meaning. This process allows the system to identify parts of speech, recognize named entities, and detect relationships between words. Next we move to natural language understanding, this is where the magic really happens. At this stage the NLP system begins to comprehend the semantic and contextual meaning of the language, it's not just about understanding individual words but about grasping the meaning of a sentence as a whole. This is where the system tackles complexities such as ambiguity, idioms, and cultural references. It's the equivalent of a chef understanding how different ingredients interact to create unique flavors. Finally, we have natural language generation. This is the step where an NLP system produces a human-like response or output. It's like a chef serving up a delicious meal after careful preparation and cooking. The system takes the insights gained from understanding the language and uses them to generate relevant responses, summaries, or translations. These three steps are not isolated but rather, they work together in a seamless process, much like the gears of a well-oiled machine. Machine learning algorithms and linguistic rules guide each step, helping the system navigate the complexities of language. Through these steps, NLP systems can transform raw text into meaningful, actionable insights. They allow our digital assistants to understand our questions, enable automatic translation between languages, and even help businesses analyze customer feedback. The possibilities are endless and we've only just begun to scratch the surface of what NLP can do. From chatbots to sentiment analysis, NLP is all around us. It's subtly woven into the fabric of our daily lives, often going unnoticed until we stop and marvel at the seamless interaction between man and machine. Take customer service, for example. More and more businesses are turning to NLP-driven chatbots to handle customer inquiries. These virtual assistants can understand and respond to a wide range of queries, providing customer support around the clock. They can even learn from past interactions constantly improving their ability to assist. But it's not just customer service where NLP is making waves. Ever wondered how your email service filters out spam? That's NLP at work too. By analyzing the language used in emails, NLP algorithms can determine whether a message is genuine or spam, protecting us from unwanted content. And then there's sentiment analysis, a powerful tool for gauging public opinion. By examining the language used in social media posts, product reviews and more, sentiment analysis can determine the general sentiment towards a product, brand or event. This is incredibly valuable for businesses, allowing them to respond to customer feedback in real time. In the healthcare industry, NLP is making strides in improving patient care. Through medical transcription services, doctors' spoken notes are converted into written records, ensuring nothing gets lost in translation. Additionally, NLP algorithms can analyze these notes along with other medical literature to aid in diagnosis and treatment. Even in our homes, NLP is a familiar presence. Virtual assistants like Alexa and Siri use NLP to understand our commands, whether we're asking for the weather forecast, setting a reminder, or playing our favorite song. These assistants are becoming more sophisticated, understanding not just what we're saying but how we're saying it, adapting to our speech patterns and preferences. In education, NLP is revolutionizing the way we learn languages. 
language learning apps use NLP to provide personalized feedback, correcting pronunciation and grammar in real time, this makes learning a new language more accessible and enjoyable than ever before. And let's not forget about machine translation. Thanks to NLP, we can instantly translate text from one language to another, breaking down communication barriers and bringing the world closer together. It's not perfect, but with each passing day, machine translation is getting better and better. These are just a few examples of how NLP is transforming our world. From business to healthcare, education to entertainment, NLP is reshaping industries and enhancing our daily lives in countless ways. And with advancements in AI and machine learning, the possibilities for future applications are virtually limitless. With such vast applications, it's clear that NLP is a game changer in our interaction with technology. It's not just about making machines understand us, but about creating a future where technology understands us, as well as we understand each other. A future where technology speaks our language, not the other way around. Like any technology, NLP is not without its challenges. Language in all its beauty and complexity is a tough nut to crack for artificial intelligence. It's not just about understanding words and grammar. It's about understanding the context, the tone, the nuances and the subtleties that make human language so rich and diverse. Consider the challenge of context. A single word can have multiple meanings depending on where and how it's used. For instance, the word bat could refer to a nocturnal creature, a sports equipment or even an eyelash in some dialects. For a machine to understand which bat we're referring to, it needs to understand the context which is no small task. Then there's the challenge of sarcasm and humor. Humans often say one thing but mean another using tone and context to convey the true meaning. Detecting and understanding this indirect language is incredibly difficult for NLP systems. It's like trying to explain a joke to someone who takes everything literally. And let's not forget about idiomatic expressions. Phrases like kick the bucket or let the cat out of the bag can leave NLP systems and non-native speakers utterly confused. These phrases don't mean what the words say literally. Instead, they have a metaphorical meaning that's understood within a particular culture or group. Despite these challenges, there's a silver lining. They present opportunities for growth and innovation in the field of NLP. With every challenge comes the chance to develop more sophisticated and nuanced AI models. The future of NLP holds limitless potential, with ongoing research and advancements in AI. Imagine a future where machines can not only understand and respond to our language but also understand our emotions, our sarcasm, our cultural idioms. A future where the line between human and machine communication becomes so blurred, it's almost non-existent. That's the future we're building towards one algorithm at a time. Despite these challenges, the future of NLP holds limitless potential, with ongoing research and advancements in AI. And that's a wrap on our journey into the world of natural language processing. We've delved into the origins of NLP, traced its evolution, and explored how it works. From simple rule-based systems of the past to today's sophisticated AI models, we've seen the transformative power of this technology in action. We've also uncovered the vast array of applications, from chatbots to sentiment analysis, that are reshaping industries and enhancing our daily lives. Yet, we've acknowledged the challenges that lie ahead, the complexity and nuance of language that make human-computer interaction a fascinating puzzle. But with ongoing research and AI advancements, the future of NLP holds boundless potential. If you enjoyed this exploration into NLP, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments. Until next time, keep riding the AI wave with us here on AI Waves channel. Welcome to AI Waves channel, your go-to spot for demystifying the future, one bite at a time. If you're fascinated by robots or wonder how machines can learn to think, you've landed in the perfect spot. Before we dive into the world of robotics and intelligent machines, hit that like button, subscribe for more content, and ring that notification bell so you never miss out on our AI adventures. A quick disclaimer. The information provided in this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. Let's embark on this journey together. Have you ever wondered how machines learn to think? How they adapt to their environment, learn from their mistakes, and perform tasks with such precision? If so, you're not alone. These questions have driven centuries of innovation, leading us to the intersection of two fascinating fields, artificial intelligence and robotics. When we say robotics, we're not just talking about the creation of mechanical beings. It's a complex blend of artificial intelligence and mechanical engineering, a marriage of mind and machine that's reshaping our world in ways we could only dream of a few decades ago. 
From the assembly lines of car manufacturing plants to the sterile environments of operating rooms, robots are not just present, they're pioneering change. But these aren't the clunky single-purpose machines of old. Today's robots are intelligent, capable of learning and adapting to their environment. And that's all thanks to the power of artificial intelligence. But how did we get here? The journey from simple machines to intelligent robots has been a long one. And it's a journey that's far from over. It's a story of innovation and discovery, of trial and error, and of the unending quest to make machines that are not just tools, but partners. In this video, we'll explore the past, present, and future of robotics. We'll delve into the history of this fascinating field, from the earliest automata to the intelligent machines of today. We'll look at how robots learn, how they're built, and how they're changing the world around us. And we'll look to the future, exploring the potential of intelligent machines and the challenges we'll face as they become an even more integral part of our lives. From manufacturing cars with precision to performing complex surgeries, robotics is reshaping our world. And with every passing day, we're learning more about what these incredible machines can do. So buckle up because we're just getting started on this exciting journey. The concept of robotics has been around for centuries, starting with the creation of simple automata. These were machines designed to follow a set sequence of actions, often used for entertainment or as tools of demonstration. Imagine a mechanical bird intricately designed to mimic the flapping of wings or the tilt of a head. That's an automaton. But as we moved into the industrial age, the need for more complex and autonomous machines grew. This led to the development of programmable machines that could perform a series of tasks independently. However, these early robots were still limited by their programming bound to the tasks they were designed for and unable to adapt to new situations or learn from their experiences. This is where the field of artificial intelligence stepped in, blending with robotics to create what we now know as intelligent machines. With the introduction of AI, robots went from being simple tools to complex beings capable of learning, adapting, and making decisions. This evolution didn't happen in the blink of an eye. It was a journey spanning decades, marked by groundbreaking research and technological advancements in both AI and mechanical engineering. The development of machine learning algorithms, for instance, allowed robots to process vast amounts of data and learn from their experiences, much like humans do. But the journey didn't stop there. As our understanding of AI deepened, we began to develop robots capable of not just learning from data, but also interacting with their environment in more nuanced ways. They started to recognize patterns, make predictions, and even understand human language to some extent. Today, intelligent machines are no longer a thing of science fiction. They're part of our everyday lives, helping us in industries ranging from healthcare to manufacturing, and even in our homes. And as we continue to refine our AI technologies and improve our engineering techniques, the capabilities of these machines will only continue to grow. The leap from simple machines to intelligent robots wasn't overnight. It involved decades of research in both AI and mechanical engineering. This synergy of fields is what fuels the advancements we see today, and it's what will drive the future of robotics. So, how do robots learn? Good question. Well, the answer lies in an exciting field of artificial intelligence called machine learning. Machine learning, in a nutshell, is the process by which machines, or in our case, robots, learn from data and their environment. Think of machine learning as the school for robots. But instead of textbooks and classrooms, these students learn through algorithms and heaps of data. These algorithms act like the brain of the robot, and the data serves as their experience or knowledge base. Just as we humans learn from our experiences, robots learn from the data provided to them. They analyze this data, identify patterns, make predictions, and then adapt their behaviors accordingly. For example, a robot can learn to recognize objects, navigate a room, or even play chess, all through the power of machine learning. But it's not just about data input and output. The real magic happens in the middle, where the robot processes the data. This is done through complex mathematical models called neural networks. These networks mimic the human brain's structure, allowing the robot to learn in a way that's eerily similar to how we do. Over time, with each new piece of data, these robots refine their understanding becoming better at the tasks they're designed to do. They can make mistakes, yes, but they also learn from these mistakes, just like us. That's the beauty of machine learning. The learning capability of robots isn't confined to a set of predefined tasks. They can learn new skills, adapt to changing environments, and even come up with solutions that we humans might not have thought of. That is the essence of intelligence, the ability to learn, 
adapt, and solve problems. So, when we talk about intelligent robots, we're not just talking about machines that can perform tasks. We're talking about machines that can learn, adapt, and grow. Robots that can think for themselves, in a sense. This learning capability is what makes a machine intelligent. It's what sets a robot apart from a simple machine. It's what makes the world of robotics so fascinating and so full of potential. So the next time you see a robot, remember, it's not just a machine. It's a learner, an adapter, a problem solver. It's an intelligent being in its own right. The application of robotics goes beyond just AI. It's a realm where the digital intelligence of artificial intelligence meets the tangible world of mechanical engineering, creating an orchestra of technology that's transforming industries and our day-to-day -day lives. Take the automotive industry, for instance. It's a sector that's been revolutionized by the advent of robotics. In modern car factories around the world, robotic arms are tirelessly at work, assembling vehicles with an extraordinary level of precision and speed. They paint, weld, and install parts, often in areas too dangerous or inaccessible for human workers. It's not just about efficiency, it's about safety, quality, and the ability to create vehicles that are more reliable and advanced than ever before. But the influence of robotics isn't confined to the factory floor. It's also making a significant impact in the healthcare industry. Robotic surgery, once a concept of science fiction, is now a reality in many hospitals. Surgeons are using robotic systems to perform complex procedures with a degree of precision that far exceeds human capability. These robotic systems allow for smaller incisions, which means less trauma to the body, reduced blood loss, and quicker recovery times. It's a leap forward in medicine that's saving lives and improving patient outcomes. In the realm of logistics and supply chain management, robotics is streamlining processes and boosting efficiency. Robots are being used for picking and packing items, managing inventory, and even delivering parcels. They're working round the clock, improving accuracy and reducing human error. These examples are just the tip of the iceberg. Robotics is permeating every corner of our society, from agriculture to space exploration, and the possibilities are endless. Consider the automotive industry, where robots assemble cars with precision and speed unmatched by human workers, or the medical field, where robotic assistants help surgeons perform delicate operations. The future of robotics is not just about technology, it's about how this technology can improve our lives, our work, and our world. But what does the future hold? The world of robotics is rapidly evolving with the future promising even more exciting and groundbreaking developments. Picture this, exploratory robots traversing the depths of our oceans, uncovering mysteries that have been hidden for centuries. Or space rovers, equipped with AI, mapping the rough terrain of distant planets and paving the way for human exploration. Imagine a world where robots are our companions, not only performing menial tasks, but also providing company understanding our emotions, and interacting in a genuinely humane way. We're talking about intelligent assistants that can learn from us, adapt to our lifestyles, and even predict our needs before we realize them, ourselves. The healthcare sector too will continue to revolutionize with the aid of robotics. From remote surgeries performed by robots controlled by human surgeons thousands of miles away, to nanobots that could travel through our bloodstream, delivering medicine directly to disease cells. The field of construction and architecture will also see a paradigm shift. Robots could build skyscrapers, bridges, and even entire cities with a level of precision and speed that far exceeds human capabilities. This could dramatically reduce construction time and costs, while also mitigating the risks associated with these jobs. In the realm of entertainment, we could have robots creating music, art, and even movies, pushing the boundaries of creativity and offering a whole new perspective to these fields. The future of robotics also hints at a world where the line between the physical and virtual world blurs. We could have virtual reality robots that can simulate any environment, allowing us to travel the world from the comfort of our homes. While this future may seem a bit far-fetched now, the pace at which robotics and artificial intelligence are advancing makes it a very real possibility. So, hold on tight as we journey into an era of boundless possibilities, where robots may become a ubiquitous part of our lives. From exploratory robots traversing the depths of our oceans to intelligent companions aiding in daily life, the future of robotics is bright and boundless. However, with great power comes great responsibility. As we marvel at the capabilities of intelligent machines and the potential they hold, it's crucial to also consider the ethical implications of this technology. 
One pressing concern is job displacement. As robots become increasingly adept at performing tasks, we need to ask ourselves, what happens to the people whose jobs are automated? Some argue that new roles will emerge to replace those lost, while others worry about a potential increase in unemployment. The rapid evolution of intelligent machines also raises questions about privacy. In a world where data is the new oil, how do we ensure that the information these machines collect and process is used ethically? From personal data gathered by AI assistants like Siri and Alexa, to the vast amounts of information processed by autonomous vehicles, the potential for misuse is substantial. Then there's the issue of accountability. When a self-driving car has an accident, who is to blame? The car's owner, the manufacturer, the programmers, or the AI itself? These are questions that our current legal systems are ill-equipped to answer. And let's not forget about the potential for intelligent machines to be used in warfare. Autonomous weapons could change the face of conflict, raising serious ethical and humanitarian concerns. There's also the question of bias. AI systems learn from data and if that data is biased, so too will be the AI. This can reinforce existing inequalities and prejudices, leading to unfair outcomes in areas like hiring, lending and law enforcement. These are just some of the ethical implications of intelligent machines. They are complex issues that require thoughtful debate, regulation, and oversight. But most importantly, they require a collective effort. These are questions that we, as a society, must tackle together. The journey of robotics and intelligent machines is not just a technological one, it's a human one. It's about ensuring that the benefits of this technology are widely shared and that its potential harms are minimized. So let's continue this conversation and work together to shape the future of intelligent machines. Thank you for joining me on this fascinating journey into the world of robotics and intelligent machines. We've explored the past, present and future of robotics, demystifying this complex world one bite at a time. We've seen how the concept of robotics has evolved from simple automata, machines following predetermined sequences, to intelligent robots capable of learning and making decisions. This leap from simple machines to intelligent beings is the result of decades of research in both artificial intelligence and mechanical engineering. We've delved into the heart of these intelligent machines, uncovering the role of artificial intelligence and machine learning. By feeding robots data and allowing them to process it through algorithms, they learn from their environment, adapting and performing tasks with increasing accuracy. We've witnessed robotics in action, from the automotive industry where robots assemble cars with precision and speed, to the medical field where robotic assistants help surgeons perform delicate operations. These examples only scratch the surface of robotics potential. And we've dared to dream about the future of AI and robotics. The possibilities are endless with exploratory robots traversing the depths of our oceans and intelligent companions aiding in daily life. But with these advancements come ethical questions. We must ensure these intelligent machines are used for the benefit of humanity, addressing issues of job displacement and privacy concerns. This journey of robotics and intelligent machines is not just a technological one, it's a human one. It requires us to rethink our relationship with technology. The future of robotics is bright and boundless, and it's a future we can shape together. So let's continue to question, explore, and innovate. Let's shape a future where technology works for us, not against us. Remember, the future is being built today, and it's a future we can shape together. Until next time, keep riding the AI waves. Welcome to AI Waves channel, your go-to source for demystifying the complex world of artificial intelligence and its groundbreaking applications. Today we're talking about a fascinating field that's transforming our world as we know it, computer vision. Now what exactly is this technology, and why should you care? Well before we dive into the fascinating world of computer vision and intelligent machines, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our future explorations into the AI universe. And remember, the content provided here is for educational and informational purposes only. Now let's get started. Computer vision in essence is the science of computers and software systems that can recognize, analyze and understand images in the same way that human vision does. But it's not just about replicating human vision, it's about augmenting it. With computer vision, machines can process and analyze visual data much faster and with much more accuracy than a human ever could. This technology leverages artificial intelligence and machine learning, teaching computers to interpret and understand the visual world. It does this through digital images, videos and other visual inputs. 
The computer can then use this understanding to recognize objects, detect patterns, or even make decisions based on the information it gathers. The inception of computer vision can be traced back to the 1960s. Still, it wasn't until the last decade, with the advent of machine learning and neural networks, that we've seen an explosion in its capabilities. Today it's so seamlessly integrated into our lives that we often take it for granted. For instance, when you unlock your phone with your face or when your social media platforms automatically recognize your friends' faces and photos, that's computer vision at work. But this is merely scratching the surface. Computer vision is transforming industries, revolutionizing healthcare, retail, automotive, and many more. It's the eyes of autonomous vehicles, the diagnostic tool in healthcare, the personal shopper in retail. The journey of computer vision started in the 1960s, but it's in the last decade that we've seen an explosion in its capabilities, thanks to advancements in machine learning and neural networks. And with the pace of progress in AI, who knows what the future holds for this exciting field? So, stay tuned as we delve deeper into the world of computer vision and its endless possibilities. Today, it's an integral part of many technologies you interact with daily, from unlocking your phone with your face to tagging friends in social media photos. But the applications of computer vision go far beyond these simple tasks, permeating a multitude of industries and transforming the way we live and work. In the healthcare sector, for instance, computer vision is a game changer. Doctors are using this technology to detect diseases early and accurately, making diagnosis not just more efficient but also more precise. It aids in patient monitoring too, tracking vital signs and alerting healthcare professionals when it detects anomalies. The retail industry is another area where computer vision is making waves. Ever walked into a store and wondered where to find a particular item? With computer vision, you can simply snap a picture of the product and the system will guide you to its location. It's also revolutionizing inventory management, automatically tracking stock levels and alerting staff when it's time to reorder. But perhaps the most exciting application of computer vision lies in the automotive industry. Here, it serves as the eyes of autonomous vehicles, interpreting the surrounding environment and making split-second decisions to ensure safety. It can recognize traffic signs, detect pedestrians, and even anticipate potential hazards before they occur. So, from healthcare to retail to automotive, computer vision is not just changing the way we do things. It's redefining what's possible. It's about more than just giving machines the ability to see. It's about equipping them with the understanding to interact intelligently with their environment, paving the way for a future where technology and humanity coexist in harmony. In automotive, it's the eyes of autonomous vehicles, making split-second decisions to ensure safety. It's the future today, a testament to the power of human ingenuity and the limitless potential of artificial intelligence. The potential of computer vision is boundless. It's not just about interpreting the visual world, but understanding it in a context that allows for autonomous action and decision-making. This insight comes from Dr. Elaine Smith, a renowned expert in the field of computer vision. She emphasizes the transformative potential of this technology, which goes beyond simply interpreting visual data. By understanding the context, it can make informed decisions and take autonomous actions, thereby revolutionizing numerous sectors from healthcare to retail, security to transportation. Professor John Becker, another luminary in the field, shares his thoughts on the future of computer vision. He says, We are just at the beginning of what computer vision can achieve. As we feed more and more data into these systems, they will continue to learn, evolve, and improve, opening up possibilities we can't even imagine today. He further explains that the key to this continuous improvement is the data that these systems process. With each image or video the system learns, improving its ability to recognize patterns and predict outcomes. This process, often referred to as deep learning, is what makes computer vision so powerful and versatile. Dr. Maya Gupta, a leading researcher in AI, brings attention to the human aspect of this technology. She states, Computer vision is not about replacing humans but augmenting our capabilities. It can help us see things that we might miss, understand patterns that are too complex for us to comprehend, and make decisions when time is critical. These experts agree that while the technology is powerful and holds great promise, it's our responsibility to guide its development and application. They remind us that as we harness the power of computer vision, 
we must also consider the ethical implications ensuring that it respects our privacy, enhances our lives, and contributes positively to society. In the words of Professor Becker, the more data it processes the better it becomes at recognizing patterns and predicting outcomes. This encapsulates the extraordinary potential of computer vision, a technology that's not just about seeing the world, but understanding it in a way that can transform how we live, work, and interact. But with great power comes great responsibility. The rise of computer vision raises important questions about privacy, ethics, and the future of work. As we journey further into the world of computer vision, we inevitably encounter its ethical implications. This technology has the power to transform our world, but it also brings challenges that we must address to ensure its responsible use. One of the key ethical issues revolves around privacy. When machines can see and interpret the world around them, they inevitably see us too. This raises the question, how much of our personal life are we willing to reveal to intelligent machines? How do we safeguard our privacy in a world where machines can recognize us, track us, and predict our behavior based on our visual data? Then there's the question of bias and fairness. Like all AI, computer vision is trained on data, and that data can carry biases. If the data used to train these systems is biased, the systems themselves can become biased, leading to unfair outcomes. For instance, facial recognition systems have been found to be less accurate for people of color, women, and older individuals. How do we ensure that computer vision technologies are fair and unbiased? Another ethical consideration is the future of work. With machines increasingly able to perform tasks that once required human vision and understanding, what happens to the jobs that relied on these skills? Will computer vision create more jobs than it displaces, or will it lead to job losses? Finally, there's the issue of accountability. When computer vision systems make mistakes, who is responsible? The developers of the system, the users, or the machine itself? How do we establish a framework for accountability in a world where machines can see and make decisions based on what they see? As we continue to advance computer vision technology, these questions will become increasingly important. We must strive to create a world where this technology respects our privacy, reflects our diverse world, enhances our work, and is accountable for its actions. How do we ensure these technologies are used for the greater good? That is the question we must continually ask ourselves as we navigate this exciting and complex landscape. Imagine a world where intelligent machines not only see but help us preserve the environment, enhance global security, and create more inclusive societies. That's the future we're looking at with the continued evolution of computer vision. In environmental conservation, computer vision could play a pivotal role. Equipped with this technology, drones could monitor wildlife populations, track migratory patterns, and even identify signs of environmental distress far more efficiently than humans. From the depths of our oceans to the farthest corners of our forests, no place would be beyond our reach or understanding. In terms of security, think of intelligent systems that can accurately identify threats and respond in real time. This could range from detecting unattended luggage in an airport to identifying suspicious behavior in crowded places. We're not just talking about reactive measures here but proactive ones that could prevent incidents before they happen. And when it comes to inclusivity, computer vision holds the key to unlocking a world of possibilities. For people with visual impairments, AI-equipped devices could narrate the visual world around them, providing a new level of independence. For those unable to communicate verbally, facial recognition and emotion detection could give them a voice they've never had before. However, these are just the tip of the iceberg. As computer vision technology becomes more sophisticated, its applications will only expand. We're talking about AI systems capable of artistic creation, advanced medical diagnosis, and even understanding and interpreting human emotions. But as we move forward, let's not forget the challenges. The ethical implications of this technology are significant, and it's crucial that we proceed with caution. From privacy concerns to the potential for misuse, we must navigate these waters carefully. As computer vision continues to evolve, it will undoubtedly unveil new horizons we've yet to imagine. The future of this technology is as exciting as it is daunting. But one thing's for sure, we're on the cusp of a new era where machines don't just see the world, they understand it. And that, dear friends, is a future worth exploring. Thank you for joining us today on this enlightening journey into the world of computer vision and intelligent machines. 
we've explored the depths of this incredible technology from its humble beginnings to its transformative applications and the ethical questions it raises. We've seen how computer vision is not just about making machines see, but empowering them to understand and interact with the world in ways we could only dream of a few years ago. It's a tool that's already changing how we live, work, and play, and its potential is only limited by our imagination and our commitment to use it responsibly. But remember, this is just the start. As we speak, researchers around the globe are pushing the boundaries of what's possible with computer vision, developing smarter algorithms, exploring new applications, and tackling the ethical challenges head-on. And as this technology continues to evolve, so too will our understanding of it. So, what's next for computer vision? Well that's a question we'll continue exploring here at AI Waves channel. We'll delve into the latest breakthroughs, talk to the experts shaping this field, and discuss the implications for our society. We'll also look at how you, yes you, can get involved, whether you're a tech enthusiast, a student, or just a curious mind. So don't miss out on this journey. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and join the conversation in the comments section. Let's learn, grow, and shape the future of AI together. And remember, every wave of innovation brings with it a wealth of opportunities and challenges. It's up to us to ride these waves, to harness their power for good, and to navigate the uncertainties they bring. So, stay curious, stay informed, and until next time, keep riding the waves of AI innovation with us. Welcome to AI Waves channel, your go-to source for demystifying the complex world of artificial intelligence. Before we dive in, make sure to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell to not miss any of our future insights into AI. Disclaimer. This video is for educational purposes only and aims to introduce concepts in a simplified manner. Hello AI enthusiasts! Today we're embarking on an exciting journey into the realms of neural networks and deep learning. These are two concepts that have taken the world of artificial intelligence by storm, powering everything from voice recognition to autonomous vehicles. But what exactly are they? Let's start by understanding neural networks. Neural networks are, in essence, an attempt to simulate the human brain. Just as our brain is made up of billions of neurons that transmit signals and process information, a neural network consists of artificial neurons or nodes that are connected in layers. These layers take in input data, process it, and output a result, much like the neurons in our brain process sensory information and produce a response. Now you might be wondering how does data pass through these layers? Well, imagine a group of office workers. A file starts with one worker, who adds a bit of information before passing it to the next worker. Each worker adds their own analysis or insight to the file, changing it slightly before sending it on its way. This process continues until the file reaches the last worker, who has a complete report ready to be delivered. In a similar fashion, in a neural network, data enters the first layer where it undergoes some initial processing, the results are then passed on to the next layer and so on, until the final layer produces the output. This could be anything from recognizing a face in an image to understanding the words spoken in an audio clip. So, in a nutshell, a neural network is a system of artificial neurons, structured in layers, that processes data and produces an output. It's a fascinating technology that's revolutionizing the way we interact with machines and interpret data. In a neural network, data passes through layers, gets processed, and finally, we get an output. Be it recognizing a face or understanding spoken words. Stay tuned as we continue to delve deeper into this captivating world of neural networks and deep learning. When we talk about deep learning we're referring to neural networks with many layers. These layers, much like the layers of an onion, each add a level of complexity to the information being processed. They enable the network to capture intricate patterns and relationships in the data, allowing the machine to make sense of the world in a way that's eerily similar to how we humans do it. Now why do we call it deep? Well, the term deep in deep learning isn't about any philosophical depth, it simply refers to the number of layers involved. The more layers a network has, the deeper it is. A deep network is capable of understanding data in a complex and abstract way, much like how a detective uncovers layers of clues to solve a mystery. But what's so special about these layers? Each layer in a deep neural network performs a specific function. The initial layers might recognize simple patterns like lines and curves in an image. As we move deeper the patterns get more complex. They may start recognizing shapes then objects and ultimately complete scenes. Just imagine it as building a complex structure brick by brick layer by layer. 
Deep learning is essentially an extension of classical neural networks, but it's this depth, this complexity, that allows deep learning models to outperform other machine learning models. They can handle vast amounts of data and extract meaningful patterns even when the data is unstructured or unlabeled. Now these deep learning models are behind the technologies that were once the stuff of science fiction. They're powering self-driving cars, voice assistants like Siri and Alexa, and even enabling computers to create art. The power of deep learning lies in its ability to learn from experience. It learns from examples and experiences, much like a child learning to identify objects or animals. It makes mistakes, learns from them, and gradually improves. Deep learning allows machines to tackle tasks that were once thought to be exclusively human domains. With deep learning, we're not just programming machines to perform tasks, we're teaching them to learn from their experiences and to improve over time, opening up a world of possibilities that we're only just beginning to explore. The applications of deep learning are everywhere. It's like an invisible force, powering technologies and innovations that we interact with every single day. Let's dive into a few examples. First up, we have the virtual assistants that live in our smartphones and homes. Siri, Alexa, Google Assistant, they're all powered by deep learning. These assistants use natural language processing, a form of deep learning to understand and respond to our voice commands. Then we have the realm of computer vision, where deep learning allows computers to see and understand images and videos. This technology is key to the development of self-driving cars, enabling them to recognize traffic signs, pedestrians, and other vehicles. It's also used in security systems to identify suspicious activities and in social media platforms for tagging friends in photos. Deep learning also plays a crucial role in healthcare. It's used in the analysis of medical images such as X-rays and MRI scans to detect diseases like cancer at early stages. It's even used to predict disease outbreaks by analyzing vast amounts of health data. In the world of entertainment, deep learning is behind the recommendation systems of platforms like Netflix and Spotify. These systems analyze your viewing or listening habits and suggest content you might like, making your binge-watching or music streaming experience more personalized. Deep learning also powers language translation apps, making it easier for us to communicate across different languages. It's even helping scientists understand complex phenomena such as climate change by analyzing large data sets and identifying patterns. And let's not forget about the world of finance where deep learning is used for fraud detection, stock market prediction, and personalized banking services. All these examples just scratch the surface of what deep learning can do. This technology is transforming almost every industry, making our lives easier, safer, and more connected. These technologies are not just changing the landscape of tech but are also having profound impacts on our daily lives and society as a whole. But how do these networks learn? This is a question that often pops up when we discuss neural networks. Well, the magic ingredient in the learning process of neural networks is a mechanism known as backpropagation. Picture this. You're trying to throw a dart at a dartboard. You make your first throw, and it's a miss. So you adjust your aim and throw again. This time you're closer, but not quite there. You continue this process, learning from each throw, until you finally hit the bullseye. That's essentially what backpropagation does. Here's how it works in a neural network. The network makes a prediction. Let's say it's trying to recognize a cat in a photograph. It then measures how far off its prediction was from the actual answer, much like how you measured how far off your dart was from the target. This error is then passed back through the network, adjusting the weights. These are the factors that determine how much influence each input has on the final prediction. The beauty of backpropagation is that it allows the network to learn from its errors, adjusting and improving with each iteration, just like you did with your dart throws. It's a process of trial and error, fine-tuning and gradual learning. Now this learning doesn't happen in a vacuum. It requires data, and lots of it. In our dart throwing analogy think of each throw as a piece of data. The more throws you made the better you became at hitting your target. Similarly, the more high-quality data a neural network is trained on, the better it becomes at making accurate predictions. In the case of our cat recognizing network, it needs thousands if not millions of images of cats to learn effectively. These images make up the training data, teaching the network what a cat looks like in all sorts of different situations. So, to sum it up, neural networks learn through a process of backpropagation, adjusting their weights based on the errors they make, and they improve with access to lots of high-quality data. 
The more high-quality data a neural network is trained on, the better it becomes at making accurate predictions. Despite their impressive capabilities, neural networks and deep learning aren't without their challenges. Let's delve into the obstacles and the future directions this technology could take. Firstly, neural networks require a ton of data to learn. We're talking about millions or even billions of data points. And not just any data but high-quality labeled data which is time-consuming and costly to produce. It's like trying to learn a new language with only a couple of words. It's a daunting task, isn't it? Secondly, there's the issue of interpretability. Neural networks, especially deep ones, are often seen as black boxes. They can make incredible predictions, but understanding why they made a particular decision is tricky, to say the least. This lack of transparency can be a hurdle, especially in fields like healthcare or finance, where explaining decisions is critical. Thirdly, we must consider ethical aspects. Bias in AI is a real concern. If the data used to train the neural network is biased, the network's output will also be biased. And then, there's privacy. As we feed more and more of our personal data into these networks, how do we ensure that our information remains secure? But don't get disheartened. Every new technology faces hurdles, and deep learning is no different. It's these challenges that drive innovation and progress. Looking ahead, the future of neural networks and deep learning is brimming with potential. We're seeing advancements in areas like few-shot learning, where networks learn from a small number of examples, and explainable AI, which aims to make these black boxes more transparent. Moreover, researchers are exploring ways to tackle bias and ensure privacy, like differential privacy, which adds noise to data to protect individual information. It's an exciting time to be in the field of AI. The road ahead may be fraught with challenges, but it's also filled with opportunities. With ongoing research and innovation, who knows what incredible milestones we'll achieve next. That's a wrap on our introduction to neural networks and deep learning. We've journeyed through the intricate workings of neural networks, understood how they mimic our brain's neurons, and discovered how they process data, layer by layer. We've delved into the depths of deep learning, seeing how it enables machines to capture complex patterns and solve problems once thought to be exclusively human domains. We've explored the ubiquitous applications of deep learning, from voice assistants to self-driving cars to medical diagnostics. We've also looked at the learning process of neural networks, understanding how they learn from mistakes and improve over time. Despite the challenges ahead, from data needs to ethical considerations, the future of neural networks and deep learning is brighter than ever. The world of AI holds many more exciting discoveries and advances to come. So, keep your curiosity alive and continue exploring this fascinating subject. Stay tuned to AI Waves for more insights into the fascinating world of artificial intelligence.